Hello, it's Keith from Kinvert, and we've got another quick video for you here. What we're going to be doing is changing Vector's eyes again. Now, this time what we're doing is pulsating his eyes. Um, and so you can basically, well, you'll, you'll see it when we, uh, oh geez, he, do, he doesn't like to be turned, like he wants to face one way. Here we go. So let's run the code, see if it's going to show up in the camera. Is it looking right? There we go. Um, so his eyes are blue, and you can see that they're pulsating between kind of a whitish and a bluish. Now they're not going all the way to white, and we're doing this with the saturation value. We're using a cosine value. We'll end up uh, linking to the code um, in the description below to uh, convert.com. Let me quick get the lights off here and uh, try and see if I can't grab Vector and get him closer to the camera so we can see his eyes. Is it going to maintain focus? It doesn't help when I move it so far out. Is it working? It seems to be working. And then let me see it. Maybe I got to manually uh, do a little bit of this focus. There we go. So yeah, we can see his eyes are pulsating there between these shades of blue. And uh, we can do a lot of other different things too with, uh, with cosine. It's actually really cool. You just got to know some of the basic math. Even if you don't, you can just uh, copy my code and run that. So check the description below to convert.com and uh, you'll be able to copy this code and use it yourself. All right, this was Keith from Kinvert, and we'll see you guys next time. Thanks.